What is up, Prince Squad? I'm back with another video, and today I'm at a different location. So if y'all want to see what I'm gonna be doing, stay tuned. T-shirt chick. All right, today I'm gonna be uh, putting a decal onto an 18 wheeler. So as you can see right here, this is the one I did years ago. I can't remember how many. You know how long ago I did that. He said, <laughs> he said 10 years ago. So this is the one I did before, but I'm gonna be changing it around cause he want a different name on there. So if y'all wanna see how everything turns out, stay tuned. All right, y'all, this one, I gotta remove this one. And as you see, I don't know if you can see that right there where it was removed on that part right here. Let me see if I can get it right there. You can see it's kind of, it kind of left a little of the stickiness, adhesive, whatever you want to call it, on here. So I'm going to be removing that and then I'm going to have to clean that off because I want it to look right. I got my vinyl scraper right here. So you use that, if I know how to use it, to get it started peeling. And see if you can get this off. I might look I might not be able to film all of this but well, basically right just peeling it off that's not gonna mess it up. Nah, I'm gonna get the paint again anyway. You you'll be back again. Oh. Wanna take it out? If you can take it out. I got fine. some blades in the house. Oh, oh if you got some blades, that's fine mm -hmm. too. This, this part is kind of tough. Yeah, and as y'all see, this is not gonna come off in the weather. Uh, it's being peeled off. I had somebody in one of the videos say they didn't think this would hold up, but you see, I'm trying to take it off after it's been on here for years, and it's hard to come off. Another thing that you could do with this, but I don't even have a long extension cord, but you can use a, a heat gun, and I got my heat gun in the car. All right, y'all, as you can see, um, this had to be scraped off with a razor. That was the only way we could figure out how to get it off right away, so let me see. See if I can get this adhesive off. I want to, because if I don't, it's gonna, I don't like, I don't want to look bad. You gotta redo it again anyway. I got some little oh, like cleaner in the house, detail clean. What would you use? Um, this is top job, basic clean. <sighs> I needed this uh, other stuff I got at the shop. All right, this uh, area right here wasn't coming off the way that we wanted it to, but since he gonna get his truck painted anyway, we're going to just put it up a little bit higher right here. So I'm going to go ahead. I got two of the decals right here. I'm going to go ahead and cut them in half. Thank you. All right. And I'm going to use 
use this as a guide going across right there. Y'all can't even see none of that, huh? Right there. All right. So what I'm trying to do is I'm lining it up with this right here. So it's gonna be about, about two fingers down from there. I might have to bring it down slightly. Let me see, two fingers. Yeah, that should be good. Two fingers from there. Yes, ma'am. Making sure that this is all stuck the way it's supposed to be. Zoom in so y'all can check it out when I take the tape off. So that's that's what it's looking like right there. And we still got to do the other side. So once I get the other side done, I'll just come back and let y'all check it out.